Today I'm gonna be unboxing the second favorite thing of a motorcycle rider. If this is the second favorite, then what is the favorite thing of a motorcycle rider? The first without a doubt will always be a brand new motorcycle. Without wasting much time, I'm gonna tell you exactly what is the second favorite thing of a biker. And if you have to think about it, if you have to use your brains about it, then bruh, are you even a true rider? The second favorite thing is definitely a helmet. A helmet is a thing that protects your head. So around a week back, I had placed an order of my brand new MT helmet. Well, I don't even know the model name of my helmet yet. But I'm gonna find out really soon because just today, I received a phone call from Blue Dart and well, they weren't delivering my helmet at home but I need to go to their main office and pick up my helmet from there. So yes, I actually wanted to unbox my helmet right out here, the way I usually do. No, I've never really unboxed a helmet out here in this very floor. I mean, you get it right bro, if you have been watching me since the past couple of years, you know how I like to unbox my helmet. Use my own freaking hands. And even she is excited about my brand new helmet. Aren't you Lucy? Wag it in if you are. No, she is barely impressed bro. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to head straight towards the town. Thankfully, the office of Blue Dart happens to be very close to my friend Asif's place. So Asif is going to receive my helmet and from Asif I'm going to take that helmet to Ashwada's place where I'm going to be doing the unboxing. So the first thing that I'll be doing today is I'll be heading straight towards Asif's store because Asif has received my package. That means I don't have to go towards the Blue Dart office and collect it myself. Yeah, I have a very bad habit of, you know, leaving my hands whenever I'm talking to you folks. Bad habit, right bro? So, dekhte, dekhte, pahunch gaya hum log Kalimpong Bazaar, Kalimpong Town. So, my helmet is finally here. My empty tango, I guess. Not very sure about the name as of now. Huh? Can I open it? No unboxing or nothing. Some more logger. Aha. Why not? Why else? Get that lion. Pour a glass of more. Wash me that one. Wash me that one. This bugger wants me to unbox my helmet right out here in the middle of the road. He wants to reach somewhere in there. Got my package and I'm very excited. Let's head towards Ashmita's place and do the unboxing. Oh bro, I am so excited. Because of the helmet, I am very uncomfortable riding my motorcycle right now. Normally, I am the one who is very comfortable and my pillion is the one who is very uncomfortable sitting behind me. But today, I am pretty sure my pillion, that is my new helmet, is very comfortable and I am the one who is very uncomfortable. Never mind bro. Can you see me smiling? I'm pretty sure my eyes tell the whole story, right? Kya kare bhai saab? Aankhi itni gulabi ho to. What is it? Finally, it's here. Now let's do the unboxing. Pata pat. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And this churi is very lagni. Very lagni. That is what I hear from the malikni of this churi. Churi basically means a knife and lagni means a very sharp knife. For my English, Hindi, Bengali speaking viewers who don't understand a word about Nepali. See, Mera vlog dekhne ka faida. Advantages of watching my vlog, you'll be learning a new language. It might take you a couple of years or so but in the end it's all worth it, isn't it bro? This is my empty helmet Which I ordered from Spartan Pro I know I saw cats singing 
doesn't matter because this is my vlog. I'm so excited, bro. I'm so excited. Smells nice. Nice. Not as nice as me, but it's nice. Finally unboxing my new helmet, bro. No, not from YouTube money. No, from savings. Look at my new helmet, isn't it beautiful? Empty Targo. Oh, what was I saying? That I'm Tango. Sorry, it's not Tango, this is Targo. No, I don't want to peel this off. You know, typical middle class ladka. I don't want to peel this off, but have to didn't even make any noise bro I wanted it to do and this is a bill a bill of what total tax among discount I don't know let me put on my helmet and for you folks this is the correct way of putting on a helmet. First, what you need to do is you need to put your visor up like this. Then, with the use of the straps, just put it on your head and hold it like this. Not like this. Some people hit the head like this. That is not the way you put your helmet. And ah, uh, new helmet, it bang, bro, it bang. Seriously. And whenever you buy a new helmet, make sure that your cheeks are pushed inside. It's because after using it for a couple of months, what is going to happen is these linings that you see out here, these are going to get a bit expanded. So it's going to be loose sometime. And whenever you buy a helmet, make sure that you go to a tailor if you don't have an inch tape. Measure your head like this and according to the size of your head, buy your helmet don't just randomly buy if someone is buying a middle size helmet or medium size helmet then my head is bigger than this so i might use l a large one or a xl extra large don't do that just spend five or ten rupees at a tailor shop just measure your head and buy the perfect helmet for your size and when you buy a new helmet try moving your head like this if your helmet doesn't move i mean if it doesn't get loose if your helmet moves along with your head, then it's the perfect size for you. If not, then bro, why did you even buy the helmet of a wrong size? Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go home in a while and I'm gonna unbox another product, probably. If not, then I'm gonna end my vlog here. Cheers! And I'm so excited! My new helmet finally! And the reason to go for an empty helmet is it's a double D ring strap not your normal strap like this in case of a fall what happens is this breaks easily and as a result your helmet can fly off from your head causing you major head injuries so it's always preferable to go for a double D ring do you see two rings you need to put it here and from the other end take the strap out and then here you have your I don't know what do you call this tap tape I guess and put it like this now this is very secure this is at least two times more secure than this normal hook hook or lock that it comes with your regular helmet yes before you complain I know I look very oily I look pathetic, right? Let me just address the elephant in the room. It's because I have not been working out and I have gained a lot of weight and weight and when that happens, I happen to give out I happen to give out a great amount of pure organic sweat. So that is not the reason why I'm talking to you once again. The reason is I have something else with me. Today seems to be a day when I take deliveries all day, isn't it? And what is it exactly? Can you guess? 
it says 3, right? Can you see that? It says 3. And this has to be the third favorite uh, unboxing of any motor, motorcycle rider, if I'm not wrong. These are boots from Yugo, Italy. I don't know how good they are, but since I got a pretty good discount on this one, I bought it. Ta da! Do you like my new boots? These are actually not motorcycle boots, but these are steel toe, steel toe boots. The reason why I bought this boot is because, you know, motorcycling boots are so damn expensive. Okay, the cheapest motorcycling boots that are available in the market are from a company named Orazo, if I'm not wrong, and they cost you somewhere around four four thousand rupees. And this one I bought it for one thousand rupees. And these are not going to be as safe as motorcycling boots, but compared to these regular shoes, these are going to be quite, what? What is the word? Tell me, it's going to be safe. So let me just try this on and then, I guess that's going to be the end of this video. Oh yes, they look just fine. Look at these boots. Comes till this length. It's way more safer than this kind of shoes. So this was entirely about my unboxing vlog where the entire day I just happened to unbox a couple of boxes and you know I showed you my regular drama. So thank you so much for making me a part of your day. Until next time, this is your brother the vlogger from the hills Priyam Gorong and I will see you very very soon. Till then take care, bye bye and cheers to life. And if you are wondering what is in the third package then I'm gonna ask you to wait for a couple of months. Not a couple of months, just wait for a month at least. That time I'm gonna tell you exactly what is this and why I ordered this. Ciao.